Hello again, welcome back to the shed. Uh, what I've got here is just a, I'm going to do a placemat and four coasters. It's all on uh, MDF board, which has been well sealed with acrylic paint. I'm just going to get rid of the bubbles a minute. And if I've got uh, if I've got any left over, I'll do, I'll do one of those um, sculptures, you know, like a jug or something. All right, the pigments I'm using today is uh, what are they called again? Perfect pearl pigments. I think they, it's basically for car paint. I'll cover that in a minute. All right. I think I will start with a bit of white. This is uh, this is uh, the only one that's not those uh, perfect pearls. This is the white. I don't know, just mica pigments. I'm not sure where I've got them now. I've got so many of these. So let's have a look. I want to get a bit of white on here first. Now this is not exactly white, it's um, titanium white. It looks a bit like gold. Alright, so let's see. Don't need much on these little coasters. I've used this uh, this one before, but never by itself. I've always sort of mixed it in with other whites. So I'm never happy with the whites I've got. Well, this, this one looks quite nice there. I'm gonna put a bit of this over it. It's a very dark teal. So the white might just uh, show it up a bit on the black black background. some uh, what is this one I think this is uh, oh it's one of the blues anyway and I've got another blue to go on that's that's a lovely color This is the uh, other, this is sapphire blue. I think the other one, the lighter one is cobalt blue. There's some gold. And the last one's uh, apple red, which also looks a really nice colour. Right, let's see what happens with this. 
And uh, let's change the number. It's uh, really not very dominant. Very nice. Yeah. Have a little bit more gold here. I ain't got much room to do anything on those. That's a lovely gold. Try a bit of that dark blue in this one as well, I think. That's nice. Feather it out a little bit more if I can. Yeah. Well, that's really nice. I don't really want to do too much with it. I'll put a little bit more of that blue in here. Right. That's just broke that red up nice. Oh, I like these. In fact, I like these better than that. So what I might do is forget all the negative space and fill it up a little. A 
bit more of the red. Gold. Definitely white. Some of the cobalt blue. And the uh, sapphire, sapphire blue. Well, I put a bit more of this in, but I mean, it just seems to disappear. I think I need a white background for this one. That's the uh, dark teal. That looks just so nice. Okay, I'm gonna leave it like that. I'll bring it down, have a look at it. I'll shut the video off and I'll start doing one of these uh, jugs. Uh, but that'll take about three days to do. So like I say, that's not bad. That, well, this is fabulous. And I think these will just progress. Just leave them now. And they will, they will progress. Okay, hold on a sec then. And we'll have a look. Um, so I'll take it from there. I never know when I'm filming when I did that. I'll tell you what, I'll just turn this light off. Does that look good? It is a beautiful day. If I put that one on. Alright, let's have a look. Here we go. That's gone in so lovely. But that, uh, that dark teal, I can't see it anywhere. <laughs> yeah, well that's nice, isn't it? And, uh, and these ones, uh, you can't really see them really. Just quickly turn that light on again. You see them a bit better now. Eh? Let's 
shrunk back a little bit there on the sides here. I'll sort that out in a minute. The sides of these I paint with uh, like liquid gold. If you can see that. I'm going to clean with that one. I'll go, just go across this one again. Just in case it didn't really work out. No, I'm happy with that. I'll just, well, yeah, I'm happy with that. Love the colours. Okay, there you go. If you like that, give us a thumbs up and, you know, subscribe. I've, I think I've got 700 subscribers now, which is... Wow, fantastic. Well, thanks a lot for watching anyway, and I'll see you next time.